What's up guys, Jake here with this week's episode of What's New TW. Got a bunch of great products here I wanna show you today. The first one we got here is Andy's Custom Bass Lures. This is the E-Series Finesse Jig. We've been waiting to get these for a long time. This is actually the jig that Edwin Evers used to win the Classic this year, this year 2016. Uh, it's taking a long time for us to get these. We finally got them. Uh, awesome little jigs. They're built out of a, a stand-up ball head. Also features a hand-tied skirt on here with um, the flat living rubber. So gives a bit tremendous action. Looks really good in the water, especially in cold, cold water situations. I mean, this thing's ready to go right out of the package. Super sharp hook. Already has the weed guard trimmed down on it for you. Um, this is a great new little jig here from Andy's Custom Lures. All right, next up, we got a bunch of stuff from Six Cents we got in. Now, this first one is the Cloud9 Magnum Square Bill. As you see, this is like a true Magnum size square bill. It's four inches long, weighs an ounce and a half. I mean, it's, it's built for catching big fish. Um, this isn't your average, you know, small half ounce square bill here. This thing also runs about six to 11 feet, so it runs a little bit deeper than your traditional square bills. But if you guys like to throw big baits, or you're just trying to put that bigger fish in the boat at the end of the day, definitely check out these uh, Magnum Square Bills from Six Cents. Another cool one that we got in from Six Cents is the Splashback Popper. Now uh, we got them in two sizes. We got them in 70 size, which comes in three eighths, and then 90 size, which comes in three quarters. As you can see, the unique shape of these poppers has like a keel-shaped body, flat top on it, Super big, extra wide, open mouth on it. Spits a lot of water, chugs great, just like your traditional poppers would do. But because of shape on these things, they actually walk really good. And the flat sides, whenever you stop them and the, the lures at rest, you actually get a lot of side to side action out of it. You get a little shimmy, produces a lot of flash and just looks like that wounded bait fish on the surface. I mean, also backed up with you know, the 3D eyes, 3D gill plates, the textured scales on them, super sharp hooks, and they got hand tied feather trebles on them. Just Great all around quality new popper out there. All right, next up from Six Sense, we got their new Movement L7 crankbait. It's a square bill crankbait. And this guy's your two to six foot running, but actually this thing's designed for being able to hunt right out of the box. I mean, a lot of guys are looking for that kind of action now. So, I mean, you can do everything with it. You do a normal square bill, you know, running through heavy cover, over tops of grass, you know, rip wrap, anything like that. But also gives, that, gives you that option that it hunts side to side without you having to, hit, to you know, contact any cover with it. So you can produce reaction strikes with it you know, just in open water. So, I mean, great little feature, great new square bill from, uh, from Six Cents. All right, next up, we got a few new ones from Rebel. This is one I know you guys are all gonna be super excited about. This is the new Super Pop R, top water popper. I know how much you guys, everyone loves throwing just a regular old school pop bars. Now the super pop bar gives you a couple little upgrades on there. It's a little bit longer, but it also has their G finish on the side of it. So, I mean, a lot, tons of flash on it. Um, also upgraded, it's got the uh, Excalibur T3 rotating trebles on it. Hand tied feather treble. It's got, you know, hair in there and some mylar. Produces a lot of flash. So, a couple cool little upgrades for, uh, for the pop bars. Um, so, now you got the super pop bar to throw in your box there. All right, next up from Rebel, this is their Super Teeny Wake R crankbait. As you can see, this thing is teeny. Uh, I think it's about an inch and a half long. It runs, you know, zero, you know, to one foot, depending on how fast you want to crank it down. I mean, there's certain times of the year where you have to go small and mimic those real small bait fish after the shad spawn or anything like that. Or you're just trying to get that small bait, you know, just over the tops of cover where you only have a foot to work with. Um, I mean, this is going to be a great little option there for you. Probably gonna have to throw this on a spinning rod because it's so small, but I mean, if you're trying to mimic those real small bait fish, I mean, check out the new Teeny Wake R from Rebel. Another one that I'm pretty excited about, these are new swim bait hooks from OMTD, the big swim bait hooks. We got them in a seven ounce size all the way up to 11 ounce size, and we have I mean, you know, weightless versions and weighted versions. You know, the big swim baits, you know, six, seven, eight, nine inch, you know, hollow bellies or solid belly swim baits are getting a lot more popular over the last couple years. Now we're getting some more hook options to cut to make sure you're all covered for that. So these are going to be great, you know, if you want to fish, you know, shallow with the weightless version, you want to fish deeper with the weighted version. Um, super wide gap, so I mean, you're going to get plenty of bite on these things. Whenever you get a fish to bite, you got plenty of room for this hook to get exposed and actually get a good hookup ratio. A uh, couple of cool things I like on these um, has really big screw lock keepers on there, so I mean, it's made for the bigger style swim baits and also has an oversized eyelet. So it's gonna be a lot better accommodating for that 20, 25, 30 pound line that, um, that it requires for throwing this big stuff. So 
Another swim bait hook to throw in the arsenal for the big baits. All right, next up, we got a new worm from Angler's Choice. This is the Crosshair 4.0 finesse worm. It's your standard little, you know, four inch finesse worm, super soft plastic. I mean, you hold it over, I mean, you see how much action is gonna be in this thing just by just holding your hand, how much it moves. Um, it's loaded down with um, scent and salt in the plastic. But the cool thing with this is you can see it comes down to a small spade tail here, and it actually has a rudder or a ridge type action here, a piece of plastic on it. So what that's gonna do is gonna be for you guys who fish, you know, you know, tidal fisheries or rivers. Um, the little rudder on there is gonna help it track straight when you're in any, any type of current situation. So if you're doing a lot of finesse fishing, but you're a lot, uh, around a lot of current, you know, rivers, tidal fisheries, anything like that, check out these new worms from Angler's Choice. All right, next up, we got a new rain suit. Winter's coming around. You guys gotta get ready for that coming up. So we got a new suit from Sims. This is their Challenger. Challenger suit. We have the jacket and we also have the bibs here. Um, they've done a great job with this suit. I know a lot of guys, including myself, you know, we can't afford a thousand dollar Gore-Tex rain suit. Um, Sims is actually coming in, meeting the demands for you guys, you know, making a suit that's more affordable but also has a ton of performance. Challenger suit comes with a two layer Torre fabric inside. So it's super breathable, super waterproof, fully taped seams, high quality zippers. Um, they got fleece lined pockets in them, you know, reinforced tool pockets, um, adjustable hems. They got contoured fit and, you know, with all the adjustability, like you, you're going to be really easy to, you know, set hooks and move around. It, you're not going to be really restricted. Um, got a bunch of great features on this suit. You know, got a couple tie downs here for, for your kill switches. Um, I think this suit's coming in $199 for the, for the jacket and $199 for the bibs. So great. I mean, great performance at an affordable price, you know, for you guys who don't want to spend a thousand bucks on a suit. So great new product from Sims. We're really stoked about it. For more detailed information on the products I, I went over with you today, please click the link or the images below. And to view everything that's new at Tackle Warehouse this week, please click the link in the description. And be sure to check back with us next week for more of What's New with TW. Thank you. Six Senses 80X wake bait. 3D gill plates, uh, 3D eyes, awesome paint job. New bait that we just came out with called the Splashback. This three quarter is gonna be really good when it comes to like school and fish. This is our E-Series finesse jig and it's hand tied with silicone and also flat living rubber.